Hi guys, welcome to today's video and today we're going to go to the track, which is not down there. So Jacob's just put on some race wheels for me, come to the Benzo and like tread and stuff, so that's nice. Um, just charging the two batteries. That, uh, we'll change the connectors from the Banzai over to, um, I don't know whether you can see in the XT60s. So um, the black one is for the Banzai and then the yellow ones are for, for the crawler, but we're going to take them anyway. Um, and yeah, I've got, I've got the drift wheels in there. I've got these little pouches and I've got the drift wheels in there. We're going to take the drift wheels with us, so when we get bored of racing, we're going to be drifting. But um, Jacob's building a hydraulic uh, Schumacher mission, so he's going to put servos in there. And they're gonna do hydraulics for that and then one of them says he's gonna keep stock and one of them is gonna do something weird with it so these are some tracks that Jacob has uh, made and they don't work apparently but yeah some tracks that's the battery charger making that he's also printed this body out it's like GMC van type body thing it says that's gonna go on the um, mission so that's gonna look cool, and then he's got loads of bodies, Tamiya Hornet, and the, that's a ZD racing thing that we found and built. That's uh, he's actually built another one. So yeah, um, I've got two, or well, one with a donor, and then some Lego. It's my charger there. So he's got his lunchbox down here. That just needs putting the body on, and then he's got this monster beetle thing, which uh, is cool. So yeah, just gonna finish charging the batteries, and uh, I'll see you at the track. Okay, so we just got set up. Uh, Jacob's got his crate in. Um, he did break it, but he's fixed it. One of the arms snapped at the end, but it's all sorted. We've got all three batteries in there, um, tools and drift ties in there. Got my crawler, that's going to be in a separate video. And we've got some batteries and stuff in there for the uh, crate. So, yeah, first we're going to do the 5300 milliamp battery, put that in the drift car, and then um, we're going to do some racing with that. Once we're through one battery, we'll probably do some drifting. But yeah, this is the track. You've all seen it before if you've seen some other videos. Um, and uh, yeah, there's a, uh, a jumping thing over there for the crating. Jacob only just dropped his phone. And uh, yeah, so it is raining a little bit, but um, that's not gonna stop us. So yeah, get this battery in and let's start racing. It's a bit windy, but um, there we go, that's that one, Jacob's going to put the body on, and uh, yeah, let's do it. My ones be better than yours, or? Yours will probably be better because it's set up for racing, this is set up for, well, both, but, got the race tyres on there, so, uh, yeah, that's, that's quite fast. Right, I'm doing this one handed by the way. Okay, so we're going to get some cinematic shots around some of the corners and then, um, yeah, I'm going to use Jacob's phone for that. It's in 4K now. Oh, really good video. So, yeah, uh, let's do it. Right, okay, so we're just going to change over the race tyres to. Uh, the drift tyres. We did crash it a bit, um, got a bit scuffed there, big scuff on the front and it has split there. But, um, you know, it's a race car, it's going to get split and uh, it's surprisingly cheap for a hobby grade, hobby grade race car, drift car, whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, we'll change over the tyres now and hopefully get some good drifting shots. <laughs> Okay, so Jacob's about to take his crate in up there. Uh, we put the drift wheels on the uh, on the high rock, but that's how fast it goes. So it was not worth it. So we're going to put them back. Well, we're not actually going to use the drift wheels because um, we made a mess of the body. Um, yeah, as you know, it's all scuffed in there. 
split there, split there, split there. There's a chunk missing there with a split, and there's a big split there. So, um, yeah, we're not going to use the drift wheels, but we're going to use the race wheels because the drift ones we just kept crashing into these. So, we need a bit more practice, but Jacob's nearly just crashed into a building. But instead of practicing, we're just going to put um, the race wheel straight on because I don't want to break it any more than it already is. It's very dirty from the race wheels, and we kept going off. There was this point. This bit, it would just, it would always, every time we were in the drift, it would go in there. Also there where that big clump of mud is, and also there where that big clump of mud is, we flipped it. Um, so yeah, I think we went off about here three times. One of the wheel gaps. So there's another thing. So yeah, we're going to put race wheels back on and do some racing. Um, at the end of this video you're going to see all of the shots that we failed there's probably about 20 of them where we've crashed and got it so yeah um, let's do that guys we've had an issue me and jacob were racing i crashed and jacob drove over me in his craton we snapped one of the spoiler struts uh, i don't know where it's gone uh, i think i'm going to get a new body for this asap because this is going to uh, we'll keep racing it. Um, yeah, find that I'll try and look for the spoiler thing. If I can't find it, then we'll leave it. Uh, I might have to make make one. I have like a screw and some nuts or something. But uh, yeah, Jacob, it's not your fault. Why don't you just have a short spoiler? Um, I might take it off to be honest, but I'll, I'll leave it no, on for no, now. No, cut there, cut there. Yeah. We, we, we could down. could take this bottom bracket off and take this bottom bracket off, and then we will put some some nut some bolts for it with like what nuts? No, 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 right, right. Just maybe. See what I've done here. See, that's yeah. flat, flat. So just cut there and cut there. Cause it's yeah. literally they the are flat. they are quite no, weak though. No, look, no, look, look at that. Flat linkages there. Right, just there. Yeah. So if you make it so it's just like down here, it looks like. We'll keep racing though. It just means I got a. Uh, it just means I got a flappy spoiler now. No. So now I think I've done about a few break it. I'll pay for it. Uh, but, um, what did you break? Oh, okay, cool. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yo, let's I, just. I, I literally just had a mini heart. Let's just not do that again. Um, I'm gonna keep racing. Keep practicing, and then um, Jacob's gonna keep doing that. So let's try not to crash into each other. Out. We'll wrap the motor to see if it's that. If it is, I'll give you my photo. It's not thing. Have we rounded that pin enough? No. It's a spare anyway. I don't know, I'll get back to you when we find out what it is, but that's not right. Alright guys, so we're just fixing the uh, what's it now? What's it called? Banzai, there we go. Um, and this motor, which is the old one out of it, uh, it's a bit squeaky and then um, it's like quite stiff as well, so we're putting that one in it, seeing if that one will work, and then uh, yeah, hopefully it should work. So I don't know what's wrong with this. It's probably got dirt or something inside it. But um, yeah, we'll see if this is the uh, solution. All right, so it's fixed. Um, I don't know what we did. I think we, we it, the, the motor was filled with dirt and stones. 
so that's why it was clicking and when it was upside down it stopped. We took the motor out and we tried that one and it didn't make a difference. So we cleaned this one out and uh, put it back in. And just to make make sure we, we check the rear diff, make sure that was okay. And uh, now it's um, quite fast. Let me uh, pick it up. Yeah, just go. Keep going, keep going.